Hi there and many thanks for looking at this video. If you're you know, on my website and you followed this link and you've come to this on YouTube or you're just randomly looking on YouTube. A bit of a famous book this one. I remember when I was a kid you know, in the library this book was always on the shelf. You know, I, I thought it was going to be a bit outdated but I actually you know, got this from a dealer you know, or a collector, someone like that. He, he was selling everything he owned and basically retiring from it. I think he was downsizing and moving abroad or somewhere like that. And I brought, you know, a lot of his stock and reference books. This one was in it. The front cover looks quite boring. You know, it looks very dated, 70s. But actually, if you open it up, it's nicer than you think. You know, it's got some rare interesting pieces on there. You know, the, the cover doesn't do it justice. It looks really dated. But when we actually get to the pictures inside, there's some really, you know, forget about the normal things like Dinky, we all know. But, you know, the look at that some really nice images pictures and it tells you all the codes at the bottom what they are it's a really really nice book like look at that you know you look at the front and just think oh it's boring template you know old stuff old dear but it's really really cool i'm not a fan of dinky even though you know i've, I've sold most of these ones in here you know at very good prices i'm i try and keep to you know the foreign more modern stuff or exclusive stuff you know I'm not into Tim Plate generally. That's what put me off with this book, first of all. But you go to the later one and it's more my cup of tea. All this type of stuff. So it's a really nice book, actually. I don't think I'm asking the world for it. It's in superb condition. It looks unread. Um, it was made by Salamander Books. Printed in Spain, which is quite cool, isn't it? Um, I'm trying to find the date. It has got some range to it. Seven ninety five. So a book like this now would be about twenty five pound now. I'm guessing if this was in my school library and I was in school in the eighties and nineties, I'm guessing it's got a date from the eighties, surely. But it's it's a nice book. I recommend that people read this. You know, if you're a collector or something like this, it's nice to have in your bookcase. And as I say, the condition for a book this old, it looks absolutely mint, like it was made yesterday. Really, really nice book. Thanks for looking at this video. Anyway, please subscribe, like that type of thing. You know, the more help I get from you, like the, the more I can help you out. You know, by putting these videos on and selling items as cheap as I do. We ship worldwide. You know, we sell collectibles at affordable prices. We we don't do toy fairs. We don't do eBay anymore. Basically, we got our own website, so we cut all these fees out eBay and PayPal and all these. We just saying that we do accept PayPal. But unlike eBay, you know, we had to pay, pay all these stupid fees and insertion fees and all stuff like that. And I would never list anything too cheap on eBay because of the fees. On my website, we list anything from 35p upwards. You know, if you want a little part for a car or a transfer, we will sell it. But we wouldn't do things like that on eBay because the listing fees just didn't make it affordable to do that. But on our website, we'll sell anything. You know, when people ask us, we might even have it in stock and it's just not listed. So, you know, don't think, you know, anything is too small for us to sell. We, we sell anything. As long as it's collectible or to do with something, we'll sell parts of cars, all sorts. Anyway, many thanks for looking. Bye-bye.